Hello! What I have for you today is a concept for an armour detection system. So let's say there's a door that requires you to be armoured up. So you go up to the door and it says, put on your helmet. Uh, we're rebels, so we don't want to. So we're going to press the button, try to open the door. But because we don't have the armour on, the door's not going to open and we're going to get an arrow to the head. So this time we have learnt our lesson and are going to put our armour on this time. So let's put on our helmet. Go up to the door press the button so the door opens up and we can go on by and there you go so how does this work it's fairly simple we've got a dispenser a dropper a hopper some redstone and a piece of soul sand here so the other day i showed a video on how to make a very compact armor equipper station so the way it worked was basically you face a dispenser into some soul sand and because of quirk in the game you could equip armor through a block through the soul sand basically and this is sort of how this works so if you didn't know this hoppers are actually better at you better than you at picking up items so if i shoot this leather cap out of this um dispenser the hopper will always pick it up before i do however if you didn't know this when you equip armor onto your body directly from the dispenser it never actually turns into an item so there's a loophole in this system. Even though hoppers are better at picking items up than us, if the item never turns into an item entity, the hopper never gets a chance to pick it up. So this is kind of how this works if you are kind of piecing it together. So when I stand here, I press the button, the dispenser is fired, and if I'm wearing a cap, i.e. I'm unavailable to have armor equipped to me, then the item will actually go into entity form, and thus the hopper will always pick up for me, okay? And if the hopper picks up, it will go into this system and it will trigger an RS Snorlatch and open the door. So that's if I have armor equipped. Whereas if I don't have armor equipped and I'm stood here and I press the button, then because of that little quirk I was talking about, you'll actually be equipped with the armor and the item will never get to the system and it will never trigger this door. So you'll notice that the the cap actually has a very low durability and the reason for that is basically uh, why i f fired an arrow so if i if i equip myself with the leather cap and i use the system again i'll actually technically be equipped with an, a helmet and it will work the next time so that's why the low durability is there so when the arrow from the dispenser hits me it will actually destroy the cap um so like I said, it is a concept, it's clearly quite rough um, and can easily be exploited in many ways. But um, the idea, the, the foundation of the idea is there and I think it uh, has some potential.